Hello, I'm Frederike Lenscheid and this is my workshop. I've always loved music and I started to play the guitar when I was nine years old and I enjoyed it quite, quite a lot actually. So I also enjoyed woodworking even as a child. So we always had a little workshop in the cellar where, where there was wood scraps that I could toy with. And when I was 15 I um, did an internship in a, in a music store and I made a guitar from a guitar making kit. So that was basically the first guitar I've ever made. Um, here I'm working on the back of my my newest guitar. This is an East Indian rosewood back, very nice red one. So I'm just shaking the braces. I'm doing with with rosewood. I'm doing three braces, um, and I'll just flip it for a second. So this is doing an inlay to the outside. So this has this decorative element in here. So. This, this strip um, supports the, the joint because it's book matched and um, now I'm shaping the, the, the bars to a, sort of a dome shape. I always um, went on carving little figurines and stuff like that. So um, I got very interested in guitar making and then I decided to attend the school in Mittenwald and did an apprenticeship there which was a very great time there were lots of very talented luthiers there at that time and uh, it was very great and inspiring Also, is great about guitar making that I find it's a craft, but it's also influ has influences from art. It's about music, and it's also about acoustics. So lots of things that genuinely interest me combine in this in this work. This is the neck of the guitar. It's in a sort of medium processed state, so it's already the neck joint has been made. There is the head plate has been joined and glued onto this but the the crown hasn't been cut and carved yet so and here I'm working on the the part that will be inside the guitar so I'm working in a Spanish construction so this part will be on the outside so this is the heel in future and this is the part that will be inside the guitar so the sides actually go into the slot and they are fixed with a wedge here so but I also want the, the inside of the guitar to be very nice and pretty so. I um, want to make a guitar that co um, combines the that the uh, the aspects mostly contributed to to traditional guitars like lots of colors and uh, very uh, and a refined subtle sound with um, a, a vibrant and powerful tone so I'm mostly trying to do this by choosing very lightweight low density tops that are still quite stiff so um, I, I want to make guitars that have a, a certain weight range in tone so they have dark full-bodied basses and still bright and shining and brilliant trebles so there's just a lot of range in the sound of the guitar when i listen to guitar concerts i always feel like the the separation of tones is very important for how well I uh, hear the music and how much I enjoy the concert and I feel that it's, it works very well on my guitars.